Hi, it's the Organic Mechanic with Kelferless.com again. Uh, find us on the internet at Kelferless.com or call us at 208-346-7194. Uh, the next product we're going to go over is our soluble humic acid powder. And uh, just so our customers and our viewers will know, when you buy our humic acid powder, it's going to come in a regular standard shipping envelope with a shipping label. There'll be, uh, it'll be discreet. We do not uh, ship anything with uh, marketing info on the back. Uh, we ship quickly and it, it'll arrive to you just like this. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the, uh, the flat rate envelope. And one thing I have to add is our shipping crew is really good at double sealing everything. Uh, we ship uh, the product in Tyvek bags to eliminate any dust or spillage or things like that. And also, uh, we send everybody a kelpforlust.com uh, coupon. And uh, there'll be a coupon code on the back of this. Just put this somewhere where you'll see it next time you need to order any nutrient. And uh, save yourself some money using the coupon code. We carry over 400 products in our store, so give us a call. Um, I'm going to go ahead and open up the Tyvek bag and see what's in See what the treasure for the day is. Oh, it's soluble humic acid. Okay, good. Uh, this humic acid, it's OMRI listed. It's organic certified. Uh, we have uh, we have used this for for probably over 12 years. It's the best product we found. It goes into solution the quickest. Uh, it's kind of a flake or a small granular form. It's uh, very easy to to work with. And, but it comes in a bag like this with mixing instructions on it. Uh, follow the instructions, you will have no problem. And if you need any advice, uh, look us up on the website. It has a how to mix section or call us. At a, the phone number is uh, listed on the label as well. And all of our packages are in sealed Ziploc bags with tape over the top to prevent any spillage. And just for ease of use, I'm just going to cut that off so we can get right to the chase here. And Again, this is our soluble humic acid. And if you're familiar with buying a liquid humic product in the store, most products are 6% or 12% humic acid by volume. So let's just say you, you bought a quart jug of humic acid for you know $16 a quart from your local grow shop or uh, garden center. And it's a great product. Humic acid has a lot of benefit. And, uh, but it's, it's come to our attention that most people have water at their growing facility. And, uh, you know, farms, indoor growers, backyard gardeners, it's, it's fairly easy to access water. And so we're trying to educate our, our users and growers and customers on, on how easy it is to make your own fertilizer products and save you money. So what I'm going to do here in this quart job is I, I'm going to make a 6% liquid solution of humic acid because that's, that's the standard uh, uh, percentage of liquid humic products on the market. And it's great because uh, our humic acid is around 80% humic acid by volume. And uh, that's, that's kind of a nationwide... Uh, uh, analysis, the laws and regulations in California are a little bit different, so we can't claim 80% humic acids in California, but the other 49 states were good. So California, you know, they try to be their own country, and I respect that, but for the other 49 states, this is 80% humic acid. <laughs> Just, that's kind of my soapbox right now, if you want me to get on it, but anyway, what we're going to do is... Uh, we're going to make a 6% uh, humic acid solution in water. And how we're going to do that, I'm going to take the soluble kelp powder and I'm going to put two dry ounces in a quart of water. And uh, about two and a half tablespoons is about one dry ounce, or excuse me, two dry ounces of material. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this humic acid in our quart jug. Level off the teaspoons here, or the tablespoons. 
Okay, I got the dry product in my little measuring cup. I'm going to put that into my quart jug. Make sure it gets in there. I'm trying to hurry this along just for the video. I know everybody has needs to take care of and they have growing solutions to solve, so I'm going to just hurry. Okay, so I got the dry material in here. I'm just going to add some water and fill up that quart. And this is where the benefit really comes in is you're not paying for water. Just use your own water. Um, a lot of people use uh, the osmosis water or filtered water or, or whatever it takes. But it, it works for anything, whether you have city water, tap water, well water. Just go ahead because the nutrients are going to be the same. And I'm just going to continue to fill this jug up. And that will probably be good. Okay, and you can see how soluble it is. It starts turning dark rapidly. And, and that's good. That's what we like to see. But once the water's in there, I'm just going to shake it up. And I'm going to make it concentrate. All right, well, that dissolved rapidly. And I would suggest, you know, just shaking it up for one minute if you have time. But you can see how dark it goes, how quickly it does that. But there we go. There is a 6% liquid humic acid solution. And uh, very easy to make, very easy to, to uh, use. And uh, it has all the benefits of humic acid. Humic is known as, as, as the natural chelator. It really helps all other nutrients become available to your plants. Um, if uh, <clears throat> it uh, really helps tap into phosphate av availability to your plants. Uh, humic is very well known for uh, binding up with the calcium molecule and releasing the phosphate molecule to the plant. And that's what makes it so beneficial in all stages is, is uh, it really helps that phosphate become available. But not only phosphate, it has a, leather, has a lot of other qualities. It's high in carbon. It does have some trace nutrient value. Uh, really good with the help of uh, 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 iron availability in the plants and, and photosynthesis availability. And some people actually use humic, humic acid as a water treatment. Um, there's just so many uses for it. But it's, again, like in all the other, other videos we have done, a little bit all the time is a lot better than a large amount applied once. So we like to apply a little bit of humic acid to everything we're doing. But uh, back to this uh, one quart of 6% uh, humic acid. Um, a lot of people will take this and uh, dilute it one ounce of this concentrate per gallon of feed water or root drench water or foliar application of water. So I'm just going to show you what that looks like here. As you can see, it's real dark. Okay, I, I overdid it a little bit, but anyway, you could take this much, add it to a gallon, an empty gallon, fill it up with water, and you'll have a ready-to-use solution. Again, root drench, foliar, soil. And a lot of our other growers and customers, they want to take the soluble powder and apply it directly to the reservoir, and we uh, that works fine. We recommend about a quarter of a teaspoon per reservoir gallon. So as you can see, it's not very much. A quarter of a teaspoon per reservoir gallon, and it turns everything black rapidly. And again, it's our soluble humic acid. It's OMRI listed. It's organic certified. Uh, everything you will need is on the label. If you need information, go to kelforless.com. It has a how to mix section, or call us at 208-346-7194. Uh, we're here to help save the growers money and to avoid you paying for water. And other than that, that's the review for our soluble humic acid product. And this is the Organic Mechanic, and I will see you in the next video.